David Hockney is an English painter, draftsman, printmaker, stage designer, and photographer. He was an important contributor to the pop art movement in the 1960s, and he's considered one of the most influential British artists of the 20th century. Take a look at several landscapes painted by David Hockney. Hockney often paints in plain air, which means he paints outside. Notice the perspective in his paintings. As the roads wind through the countryside, they become more and more narrow until they disappear in the distance on the horizon line. You can see that the objects farther away are smaller and closer to the top of the picture, and the objects closer to the viewer are larger and at the bottom of the painting. Today, let's create a landscape in perspective like David Hockney. For this drawing, you'll need a sheet of paper, something you can draw with, and something to add color. Start by drawing a horizon line close to the top of your paper. The horizon line is what separates the ground from the sky. Add a dot for the vanishing point somewhere on your horizon line. This is where the road will vanish from your eyesight in the distance. Then add two dots at the bottom of your paper where the road is closest to you. Draw a curved line from one of the dots at the bottom of your paper up to the vanishing point. Then draw another curved line from the vanishing point down to the other dot at the bottom of the paper. Draw large trees at the bottom of your paper in the foreground. These are going to be the biggest trees because they're the closest to you. In the middle of your paper, let's draw another line. This will be the middle ground. Add medium sized trees on the middle ground. In the background, draw the smallest trees. They are the farthest away. Add lines to break up the land into different sections. Add curved lines in the foreground that follow the road. and stripes on the other side of the road.
The lines on the road that are closest to you are longer. As you move back towards the vanishing point, the lines start to get shorter. When you're ready, you can color your picture.